All right, so we're ready to go. Maddie's first flight. You excited? Are you nervous? A, a little bit? All right, it's okay. It's going to be a little windy today, but it'll, it'll be good. Matthew, you good? You guys ready? Let's roll. Goose Creek traffic, Cherokee uh, 905091 is taking off 04. We'll be uh, flying in a pattern until downwind and departing the pattern on a downwind heading 220, Goose Creek. And if you want, you could follow me on the rudder pedals or on the yoke if you want. It's totally up to you. Are you guys ready? All right. County uh, Piper Cherokee 950901 is um, three miles to the uh, southeast of the airport, uh, uh, northeast of the airport. We'll be entering at 45 for a downwind 06 full stop. Lancaster. Big Carolina. Lancaster County Cherokee 0901 is turning downwind for 06. Lancaster. Big Carolina 2390 You see the runway? Yeah. Three mile final. Turning out? And yeah, we're going to go a little further out, so this is called downwind. Okay. And then we're going to turn left, which is base, and then we're going to turn final. Oh, gotcha. Most airports are, have what's called left pattern, or left pattern traffic, so you always make left turns. Lancaster County, Cherokee 0901 is turning base for 06, Lancaster. Now I can see that I'm high, so I'm going to reduce my throttle. Throttle. Uh, Throttle is you're up and down. I'm going to do two flaps and then I'm going to turn final. Lancaster County, Cherokee 0901 is turning final 06. Lancaster. See, now we're very high, right? Speed is, is good, but we're high. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do a forward slip, which is I, I lean the aircraft sideways and I do opposite rudder. And what that does is it creates a lot of drag on the side of the aircraft and the aircraft uh, descends at a much higher rate. I'm going to do this until I re-establish re my glide path, and there we go. Now we just throttle down to idle, and then roll out. Hold it off, hold it off, and there we go. For all that wind and choppiness, that was actually a pretty smooth final approach there on final, wasn't it? Yeah. It makes a big difference when, when the wind's coming right down the runway, it really does. I mean, if that was a crosswind or like a gusty crosswind, it would have been choppy and dicey. I mean, it wouldn't have been dicey, otherwise I wouldn't have flown, but, you know, yeah. it, would have been, it would have been a lot less enjoyable for all parties involved. Definitely wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. 